Watch this video now if you're looking how to set up a domain email with Yahoo because you too want to stop wasting your time by logging in to several email accounts, right? Okay then, keep watching this video until the end because the solution is coming up. My name is Joaquin Palacios and I'm going to start by assuming that you already have a Yahoo email address. In my case, I'm going to use Yahoo, I mean Palacios at yahoo.com and you also need to have a domain name email address. In my case is demo at joaquinpalacios.com. So what you want to do is to be able to send and receive emails using your Yahoo account, right? So what you need to do first is go to the gear icon, then click on settings. Next, click on accounts. And as you can see, I already have another email address here, which is this site domain name I also use. Today I'm going to add the one that ends in joaquinpalaces.com, which is my domain name. So I'm going to go ahead and click add. You need to do the same. And this is how people are going to see your name, who is sending the email they are receiving. In my case, I only want to show my name. So I'm going to erase add and Yahoo. Email address, well, like I previously showed you, it's demo at joaquinpalacios.com. Okay, the description, I'm going to put my email address from my domain name. Okay, the reply to address, I want it to be the same one, the same email address. I'm configuring right now. So I select it, delete it, then I select this one, I copy it and then paste it here, okay? Because I want to be able to send and also receive emails in my Yahoo email account, I, I'm going to check off this option, which is, which is set up to receive emails. I check off, check it off, then my username is correct, and then I have to put the password I want to receive all the incoming emails in my inbox, my Yahoo inbox, okay? So I'm going to leave this as it is. These are the options. Just leave it in the inbox. And the pop server is for the incoming emails. And you, you, can, you can see the pop server you need to put here in this box by going to, your, to where you host your domain name and also your email address, all right? So I'm going to go to HostGator in my case, to so the control panel. I go all the way down and on this left hand side column, I see the name servers. The first one is always the one you use to for receiving or for incoming emails. So I'm going to select it, copy it and go back to Yahoo and paste it here. The other one is for sending emails, but you don't need to put it here in Yahoo. You need to put it in Gmail and Hotmail, but not in Yahoo. So this is it for, for Yahoo, right? I like to leave the first option and the second one checked off, not this one. You want to leave this checked off because you want to use a secure server, all right? And you also want to leave a copy of the, of the incoming emails because you want to be able to check your emails from your desktop, your tablet, your smartphone, etc. So next, click on the save button. Now what you need to do is go back to the domain name email address and check for an email that Yahoo sent you. Okay. Here it is. Can you see this? It's a new email I just got. Please verify your alternate email address. Yahoo sent it, like I told you a few seconds ago. You click on it. It opens up and you just need to click on this link to complete the verification process. So um, I go ahead and do it. And it says, thanks, your email address is now verified. So now, if I refresh this, uh, well, I'm going to click Save first. And if I refresh it, you'll see that it's already verified. Okay. I go to the gear icon, then Settings, then to Accounts. And as you can see, it's already verified and it's right here. Well, that's it. It's very easy, huh? You can now send and receive emails 
from your Yahoo email address and also from your domain name email address. The best way I can give back to you for watching this video is to show you a few tools I use to make money online part-time and from home. If interested, click the information icon that's above me now because this is where I reveal them. Again, thanks for watching this video all the way to the end. Talk soon.